Hi guys. So I know it's been a while, a really long while. Uh, a lot of things happened. Uh, uh, I got pregnant, and it was a hard, very hard uh, pregnancy. I was bedridden for about what four months. Four months. Yeah. So. Uh, I miscarried at eight weeks, uh, there were two in there, and they found the second one when they went to do the ultrasound to see if I had uh, gotten everything out, and there was another one. So after they found out at eight weeks that I was still, you know, I'd miscarried and I still had one, I was put on bed rest, and uh, I was just trying to keep everything as stress-free as possible so that, uh, to give the baby the best chance when they, you know, uh, figured out what was going on, uh, there wasn't much they could do about it. Uh, apparently I have a dynamic cervix, which causes me to miscarry a lot. And by the time they found it, it was too late for them to do the normal cerclage. And they tried pessary, which didn't work. So I went into preterm labor at 28 weeks and five days. Uh, I was hospitalized, they stopped the labor, I was put on magnesium sulfate, and uh, ibuprofen for three days. Day four, I was convincing them to let me go home, because nothing was happening, when I started to go into labor again. So, uh, I gave birth at 29 weeks in one day to Titus Xavier Nichols. He has been in the NICU since May 24th. So uh, I am, he was, we, we started out in Wilmington, North Carolina. He caught neck, which is uh, necrotizing enterocolitis, which, yes, my, my fiance just made a face at me because I pronounced it right. Go mommy. Um, but uh, we, we, he was transferred up to UNC Chapel Hill and we have been staying at the Ronald McDonald House for the past month. So I've had, you know, a rough time and he's, he's still there. Uh, the neck is cleared up, but we're having issues now with his, his digestion. They're thinking well, he's probably gonna need uh, surgery to remove a stricture from his head. And Ow, so here, here we are. But I've had some very wonderful ladies sending us uh, donations, um, trying to help us out because we're having to pay to live in two places, pretty much. Um, one, one, one of my ladies decided to Brother. try to make me smile and won me two candle raffles the first of which was for Makana uh, Makana candles I think that's how it's pronounced I am not gonna promise you it's M-A-K-A-N-A -A -A candles by Mickey um, you can find her on Etsy uh, I got the peach cobbler as you can see I'm burning it I'm not going to do this review yet. Uh, I just wanted to give you guys an update and let you know why I haven't been doing reveals. This is about ready to be revealed, but that'll be another video. So I just wanted to let everybody know where I've been, and uh, this what this will be followed by the reveal. So I want you know God bless and have a good day.